we give congressional franchises pagkakailangan mo ng, ng frequency precisely because of the finiteness of the frequencies. Ni po ba? Yes. Digital technology diminishes the finiteness. It multiplies, doesn't make it uh, uh, infinite. I don't know. But it certainly is not as finite as before. I guess my yes. question is, does the technology or should the current technology change our discussions about the value of frequencies and to that point, the need for congressional franchises? Well, congressional franchise has been there since 1931. No? And I think we are now the only country in the world that gives uh, franchises before we even award frequencies. No? In other words, uh, Congress, it's a law no? that Congress makes uh, giving a franchise to a company and it is signed by the president. Uh, and only after a company gets a congressional franchise, then it is the only time it will go to uh, NTC mm. to get the frequencies it needs. Mm. No? So, ganyan po ang procedure sa atin. Uh, uh, in other countries like US, uh, direct kagad sila sa FCC. No? Mm. Uh, they, they, they don't need to go to Congress to get a franchise. Mm. Uh, so, that is how we are now. No? And uh, technology, I, as I've said, uh, makes the efficient use of spectrum. No? But in this uh, particular case, uh, the whole spectrum of uh, the analog uh, channel was given to a new company. No? Hmm. And this uh, actually, uh, when, when, in other words, uh, had ABS-CBN retained its franchise and uh, come uh, next year, 2023, then uh, it has to hope whether it will retain the full bandwidth no, for mm. its analog and come up with seven channels. But if they do that, then they have to pay the government uh, 60 million per digital channel that they retain. Mm. So, so if they cannot, in other words, so what will you do with seven channels if you can only make money with uh, three or, or two? No? Mm. So these are things that uh, the company must uh, decide. And what they can, they will not uh, retain, then they have to, it becomes available for other uh, stations to use. Hmm. So do think lang po yun, as you said, no, tayo na lang yung nagbibigay pa ng, ng prangkisa. Uh, why is that? Are we behind on, uh, why are we behind on that, on that trend? Well, actually, I think we are behind because we never uh, amended or uh, uh, modernized the uh, Act number 3846 since 1931. Mm. It's still the same uh, law that we are uh, applying up to now. Mm. Well, considering the evolution of the technology down the road, you're seeing the, that one day we will no longer need congressional franchises for, for this, this industry. Yes, yes, because right now technology is showing us that you know, I, a, a private person can really broadcast, have uh, as many uh, subscribers as, uh, as, uh, a, a, uh, as ABS-CBN, hmm. as long as he has the content no, that people are interested in.